We were in the same research group, so we met in some meetings, so we initially became friendly. Uh, but yeah, I think you invited me out for coffee, but that didn't happen straight away. Uh, yeah, he said no. <laughs> but then later on we got chatting a bit more, and then I think our first date actually ended up being a bar on the River Thames. Yeah, uh, I Woody's. got him lots of drinks. Yeah, I remember it specifically as it was Oktoberfest. But. Yeah, <laughs> two litres of pints. Yeah. Yeah, got him drunk yeah. and he confessed all his feelings. And that's feelings. when I fell in love. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> he's very clever, he's very... Um, he has a, such a good heart. He's very caring. Yeah, and he's very friendly, you know. No bad feelings. <laughs> oh, well, she was just so, like, her personality was very uh, strong and she was very funny and she always knew how to bring a smile to people's faces. And then just really, obviously, from being such a kind of very humble person in her own intelligence, and she, but she would always push herself to work as hard as she could. And that really drove me, alongside, obviously, being amazing looking. <laughs> um, that was really kind of like 10 out of 10 for me. Obviously we got married and we're writing our thesis up during Covid, so obviously planning a wedding while writing a thesis, preparing for a viva, which is one of the most stressful times yeah. in your life. Obviously with each other, there were some down days for one of us and we had to keep each other up. As I'm from a different country and I haven't seen my family for over two years, it was very down for me, you know. And and I was there, uh, Cameron always helped me out and I was, I mean, everyone was like stress writing the faces, very hard thing to do and we were always there each other to support, it's very, it's very big um, achievement for us I think. So we got married in Kingston at the Guild Hall and then we actually had our reception at the Picton Room on campus itself, uh, so by that point we were actually staff at the university, because yeah. uh, we're currently doing our postdocs. We were then actually able to have it in the Picton room because we looked around in post-COVID for the kind of place we were. It was very expensive, but Kingston University really actually helped in allowing us to use the Picton room, and it allowed yeah. a lot of the lecturers and, and the staff members are yeah, really, staff really members, lovely. Yeah, yeah. you all were able to come and see. They're it. very welcoming as yeah. well. Proud to graduate from Kingston University. Yeah, yeah. And yes, I have to always thank Kingston for having us meet um, and then obviously help being a big part of our wedding as well and just our lives in general at the moment so yeah. it's been it's a good really lovely place five to years. Work, yeah.